in my career now, just over 30 years, I really would have thought we wouldn't be having a conversation about the need for greater diversity. Uh, the, there's recent research that shows that the uh, representation of women in ASX 200 companies is flatlined. There's research that supports the fact that, uh, that a diverse uh, leadership team actually delivers better financial outcomes. So there's empirical evidence to support it, but we don't seem to be making any progress. And, and that's really disappointing. And I would like to think over the next 5, 10 and 15 years that we actually start to see more action taken to create more diverse workplaces, to see more diversity at leadership levels across not only the ASX 200, but across corporate Australia more broadly. So I think that that's an important theme that hopefully will continue to drive some of the uh, changes we see over the next decade or so. Elizabeth, you've been quoted as saying that uh, diversity is not only the right thing to do, it's the smart thing to do. Why do you think we're still not gaining diversity? That's a great question, Natasha, and I wish I had the answer because I, you know, diversity is the smart thing to do. There is so much evidence that demonstrates that diversity really drives better outcomes. And diversity is not just about gender, it's also about ethnicity. Uh, you know, there's, there's a range of, of factors that contribute to better outcomes. And if I think about a typical meeting room, if everybody in that meeting room was of exactly the same background, exactly the same gender, you may not get any diverse thoughts and ideas. And at Fortescue, we pride ourselves in innovation, and that's why we encourage diversity, because we have a room full of different people from different backgrounds, different genders, different ethnicities, and that's where we get the great ideas that really drive that sort of success that we've seen over the last 17 years that we've been operating. So I actually just don't get it. I don't get it why diversity isn't on the agenda of boards as a topic that they actually actively review and discuss. We've seen some recent examples in corporate Australia of continued poor behaviour, um, and that's leading to some really unacceptable outcomes. And I think if there was a, a broader focus on diversity, then we may not have seen some of those outcomes. And, the, and stakeholders are going to demand more change, and I think the smart companies will actually start to uh, embrace that and be more proactive in driving change. Mm -hmm.